Hi, Lauren. Yeah, he's the commander of the Joint Force headquarters in the Capital Region, the military district of Washington, where it may be cold here, but you were just saying they have, what, like eight inches of snow About down? About eight inches on the snow, uh, uh, eight inches of snow on the ground there, so... Uh, great day to be in New York City. <laughs> always is, especially today. Talk about the military tradition in this parade. They really are intertwined. It is, you know, and it, we we like to think of New York as an army town. We love to come up here and visit. We're going to be back here on the 13th and 14th of June with a big celebration in uh, Bryant's Park for our, the Army's birthday. I know you guys work a lot of parades and you go to a lot of events. What's unique about the St. Patrick's Day Parade here in New York? Well, it's military tradition throughout the uh, throughout the city. You know, the 69th Infantry Regiment, what a great tradition. They led off the parade today. New York National Guard's a great organization, and uh, we're very, very happy to be here. And even on a cold day, I'm, I'm guessing you get a warm reception as you walk the Green Line. Absolutely. No, everybody here is great. And, and once again, it's a great day to be here. Thanks for all. And well, thank you very much, sir. Appreciate it. And happy St. Patrick's Day. Thank you. Appreciate it. Just part of the, one of the many traditions that we see here at the parade every year. Lauren, we'll send it back to you.